What is up, boys and girls? Part two, WTVC at night. This is Liquid. Sitting along side of me is my good friend Tyler. I'm here. That's right. I think. I- I'm in the daze, man. I'm in the daze. What day? Friday. <laughs> You're still on Friday. I'm still on Friday. <laughs> that's just how my that's just how it is right now. Well, okay. Sorry, sorry to being a bad bad week for you. Uh, sorry, it's just man. I'm I don't know. All of a sudden, I'm like tired. I don't know what's going on with that. It's a blucky day here. It is. Check local listings. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of dead today, man. Usually the store is packed and people are like, you know, participating in the show. Yeah. Is there something going on that we don't know about? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they got sick of participating in the show. <laughs> Maybe. Where's Team Flavor at? We're not gonna Yeah, no doubt, huh? Hashtag Team we, Flavor. We don't we don't wanna we don't wanna be there because we know they're there. That's exactly what it is. That's why the to. phone's ringing off the hook and it's everybody are they done yet? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> that, that, that's what it was. You posted it on uh West Texas Vaping Coalition on nobody wants to show up to vape check. Yeah. They're like, uh oh. Thanks for showing up guys. Appreciate it. Glad to see our fifteen minutes is completely over. But we are back. Second half. We decided to split it up. Um, it works better this way. So Definitely. Gives you, you know, 30 minutes to listen to or so. And then you can listen to the second part, you know, whenever you need to. That's right. You might, you know, be on your way to work or maybe something happens where, you know, you got to push pause or you really don't want to because you think you might miss something. I think I broke it. <laughs> <laughs> you just broke your new box. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You, did you got, you got the batteries in the right way? No. Yeah. They're so both going the same way. That's what they're supposed to be. It's parallel build. Best 75 bucks you ever spent. Yeah, what the hell is up with this shit? That's why I buy. Hush. Anyway, um, once again, back here at the Vape Shack, Odessa, Texas. I wanted to liquid on this problem. Oh, my God. Seasoned veteran here. And Extremely. Told you, man. Noob. I'm in the days, man. Seasoned, seasoned veteran, newbie mistakes. Yeah. Well, but that's what we're here for. The struggle through. So, Jesus. God. <laughs> <laughs> Chisholm's here. He made his way in. What's up, Chisholm? What's going on, Chisholm? He's like, I ain't saying nothing. He's like, I don't like you guys. <laughs> He's like, I thought you were done. Damn it. <laughs> that coffee might be cold, so enjoy. Just put some <laughs> ice in it, man. Make yourself an ice cap. Yeah, why not? Ice cappuccino. So, uh, what else, man? What else? I don't know. What are we talking about this half an hour? Um, mm-hmm. Usually we have someone to interview, but uh, we're kind of out of those options today. I'm waiting for my phone to ring, to tell you the truth. This is the part where you're supposed to go, why? Why? <laughs> funny, you sh- <laughs> funny you should ask. Now, my son is at um, he's at a challenge camp for the Boy Scouts. Right. And uh, he really wanted to go because, you know, he loves the camping trips. But it's a challenge camp, so it's a little bit different. He's got to start off with, uh, I guess he's got to, like, climb up a, an 80-foot wall. He, there's teams of four. They really? gotta, yeah, they got to climb up an 80-foot wall, and at the top of the wall, there's a compass to find out where to go. They got to like, run like a mile or something to get down the wall. Then they have to get into the river. All four of them have to get into a canoe in deep water. Then they have to paddle down the river so many miles, pull the canoe out of the river, up into the bank, and then three people get wood ready to start a fire, and the fourth one has to swim across the river, pick up one match out of a bag, Swim back across the river, keeping that match dry. Wow. <laughs> and start to fire, and I guess whoever does it in the fastest times wins. This sounds like an Uber challenge. We should do it. <laughs> oh, they asked the parents. They said, well, you know, if you guys want to show up, you know, you want to help out. Hell no, I did it. I did it when I was a scout. I put my dues in. But I guess their uh, <laughs> their mercy rule, they said uh, they actually had to stop because the, the, the team couldn't start a fire last year, and it was 14 trips oh, across no. the – Oh, Hashtag fail. Sad day. Just spilled his unicorn milk all over the table. Just a moment of silence, please. Moment of silence. Moment of silence for the spilled unicorn milk. Yeah. There you go. Good I'll, I'll hook you up, brother. I'll refill your bottle for you. Oh man, you're you're a homie. <laughs> <laughs> I don't buy fifteen mil bottles, dude. I buy. What the Dude, hell is I'm your problem? Gonna, I'm just gonna give it up today, man. I'm just I'm out. I'm going home. <laughs> Maybe not have Ladies and gentlemen. Uh, hold on one second here. I'm gonna I'm gonna participate in the program here. <laughs> Are you gonna drop something? Uh, no. Damn it. <laughs> no, what I'm gonna do is 
You want to take a picture of the mess I've made? Mark, there is a picture of Tyler's side of the table. It's a damn mess. Mark 2. There is a picture of my side of the table. No, I mind you. I'm the guy running all the equipment over <laughs> here, so I don't want to hear it. He ain't running shit. All he's doing is running juice out of his bottle. Amen to that. <laughs> that's, that's what you're doing. Dude. Oh, I love man. this so much, I'm just going to throw it all over the table. Anyway. Hey, got to smell it, right? So so he's off doing that, and you know, he has his stuff in his little backpack. And the, the funny thing is, this is the greatest thing. He left Friday at 5 o'clock. He'll be back Sunday around 7, right? Xavier's okay. afraid to poop anywhere but home. Oh, it's going to be an uncomfortable weekend. So, he is not going to poop until he comes home. And I don't know, because before he left, I went and got him Arby's. So, he had Arby's right before he left. So, I think I think he's going to poop. Uh-oh, the Rev's handing us something. What's up, Rev? Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't work. I was handed to ooh. What is, bueno. what is going on? Are they all like that? I, can, I mean, I can get it on. You're not gonna get it off. <laughs> we need to be able to take that off. Try another Addy. Try another Addy. Maybe there's something wrong with these threads, or maybe there's something wrong with these threads. I don't know, because that's really you. You think that that would fit beautifully, Perfect. yeah, and it doesn't for some strange reason. That's ah, well. insane. It happens. It's a struggle. It's real. It is a struggle. And Strug- it is real. The struggle is real. So real, we can taste it. So, yeah, I'm waiting for him. He took his cell phone with him, so I'm waiting for him to uh, call me and say, Daddy, come get me. Where's this camp at? How far away? <sighs> trying to think. It was. I'm t- See, I'm not, from, I'm not from around here. Oh. So, I'm from Ohio, me. and I'm not really sure of these little towns. I want. I keep on wanting to say Enterprise, but I, don't, I know that's not it. Junction? Does that sound familiar? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Like I, I anybody, know. anybody know where the Boy Scout camp is? Junction. Junction. Right, jun- how far away is that? Okay, so he's about not. See, I'm not going to get him. He's going to have to stay there. Well, well, he'll be, he'll be all right. Do they get comfortable pooping somewhere else? Or I told him I said dig a hole, poop in it, and cover it up. No, that's gross. I'm like, it's the <laughs> same thing. It's just there's no flush handle. Right. So, so that's going on with my son. What about you? Anything at all? Uh, drama sister here. Oh, okay. Go ahead. Take care of your business. Uh, she, she, she's yelling at me for telling something I didn't know was a secret. <laughs> Apparently, it was a secret. Family issues, man. Every uh, family has them. Unfortunately, any family do. tells you that they have no problems whatsoever is a lying family. There is no Huxtables, ladies and gentlemen. They do not exist. That's why the show was canceled. We're all dysfunctional. We're all we're more like All in the Family. If anybody's old enough to remember All in the Family, I'm not. Really? I don't. I you know when I grew up, you know I had a television, but it was never on. <laughs> <laughs> I was one of those kids that was forced to play outside. You were forced to play outside, or you wanted to? Both. Yeah, I got that problem. Say, like, usually turning to go tear apart. You know, I usually started tearing things apart. Lawn mower was the first victim. Was it really? Yeah, I couldn't get it back together though. Then you didn't have to cut the grass. Oh no! I win did. win. A uh, pair of scissors. Oh hell! But luckily enough, it was a very small yard. There you go. There so you go. it was okay. Well, Xavier, the way that I the way that I that I I punish him is I make him go outside and play. Because he doesn't like. He play doesn't. Outside. No, he's like, dude. He's supposed to be Mexican. He's half. He's like a shade away from clear. You know, he goes outside and his eyes are all pink and he's like all pasty and starting to burn and I'm like, dude, go outside and play. Like, and then I got him that doom buggy. <laughs> he's got that razor. Right. You think, I mean, dude, if I was his age and I bet they're playing on, I, I want to go play on that right now. I would go <laughs> cut the grass. I'd get 20 bucks in my pocket. I'd be on that thing till night fell. Right. Maybe afterwards because there's headlights. And it, it, you got to have 20 bucks for gas. And then, then he got caught by the cops for riding it, right? Right, right, right. You, you know what he that. did? Huh. He came straight back home. What? I'm like, dude, you're in a doom buggy. I said, tear off into the field. They're not going to chase you. <laughs> no kidding, because the cops, what they drive, Crown Vicks, man, they ain't going to make it. No. I just, and then the guy came in and he yelled at me. He said, you know. Your kids can't be riding on the side of the road. I'm like, they ride horses on the side of the road. Oh, geez, Louise. Hold on one second. That's a struggle. Yeah, somebody, somebody's calling in. They probably don't want to be on the air. So uh, Hello. we're going to talk about the struggle. But uh, no, I mean, if I had one of those things, I'd be out playing it right now. I'd be podcasting from there. Wait, wait, wait. Here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. 
don't know what this is. Somebody's yelling at me in Spanish, but. <laughs> really? Yeah, they're not doing it. No- oh, they, oh they hung up on you. <clears throat> That's no fun. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm a northern Mexican. I don't speak Spanish. Uh-oh. Um, we I got only somebody got- else walking up to us. <sighs> Whoa, what? Okay. It's a Vulcan and a Stingray and a the Liberty and the, the Vulcan. What about it? It looks, no, it looks really good. It looks good. The lines in it are nice. Well, I mean, it works because you got the fins on top and yeah. the fins on the bottom. It looks yeah. good. So you, you stopped the show to tell me that, that he already told me three minutes ago? And we already tried to screw that on? The so but the, the question st- is, does the V2 screw into it? Oh. Well, what happened to the V2s? Y'all sell them all? Oh, I see how that is. Did you really? Wow. What about the Tuggies? Did you sell all those too? No got tug boats? What um, about, uh, do you have any SOVs left? I might pick up an SOV. What is an SOV? The Science of Vaping, the dripper. There's a bottom feed kit for it too, so I can put it on my squonk box whenever I get it. Maybe is that a 16 or a 22? Uh, it's a 22. But 22. you got a 16 cup coming. Shit happens. <laughs> Order another one. I'll put an extension on it. <laughs> there you go. Order another one. Screw it. I well for 165 bucks, man. I'm thinking. I'm thinking about getting in on that. I'm picking one of those up. Actually, check this out. Let me show you this. I know this is, this is great radio, right? Hey, let me show you something. This is the point of this, though. This is, this is us being random. I mean, here's like mods. I texted him yesterday. Said, "Hey, brother, just checking in on the progress of my mod. Hi, Wednesday or Thursday, I send your box mod. I apologize for the delay." I work now complete lot 40 pieces. Thanks for understanding. Hey. So I'll have it in. I'll have it hopefully. But well, it's, it's, well, a, it's, a, don- it's a donkey in a boat, so good luck. That's yeah, according to Team Flavor. Yeah. Hashtag Team Flavor. Insert here. <laughs> yeah. There you go. You want to get in on the TI? I'm thinking about it. That was a nice mod. The variant? No. I said they got five more spots open up. X1 if you want to give me 700 bucks. <laughs> no. Why not? Vape someone's coming up. 21 comments. I wonder if anybody. 1x1. Wow. No. Uh, my whole thing is, is you know, it's. Two, three, four. Vape someone's coming up and I need to buy something shiny. What are you looking for? I don't. That's the whole thing. Like, I don't know. I think I'm just going to go in there a couple grand and be like, okay, what do I want? That's all I'm going to do. Like, I'm just going to walk really? up in there and be like, hmm, that looks good. I'm about to make it rain in this vape shop. <laughs> <laughs> or this vape convention. Convention. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully we'll see you guys over at. Uh, Vape Over Summit. Vape Summit. Uh, mm-hmm. That is no, November, November 7th, 7th and 8th. 7th and 8th. In Houston. Houston. We need to figure out details on that. Um, we'll talk about that later, though. Yeah. That's going to be a good time, though. I think we're going to be broadcasting over there, too. We are. You think we'll be live by then? Hopefully. That's the plan. I've cool. Been, you know, been working on that. You know, that's the plan, guys, is to actually get this thing live so you guys can actually you know, interact with us. Not have to show up to the vape, vape Shack or wherever we may be recording at that week. We're not going to be recording. We're going to be live. We'll be but we'll still too. have podcasts, though, right? So they can go back and... Exactly. We'll still be able to record it and upload it so that way everyone can still check it out if they were not able to catch it live um, on the show. Obviously, we don't... Right now, there's not really a set time when we do this, and we need to figure that out. Yeah. That's another issue with the struggle. Well, it seems like we've always, we've, we're always here before three, so... Um, well, it was early today. It was. Take care, brother. We're definitely doing this really early today, but the nice part is we can always come back and revisit... A third time if we need to. Yeah, but I'm just saying maybe we should do that. Maybe we should, well, I mean, because three seems to be working. Yeah, it's so. it's quiet here, which is you know helpful. And it's not very often it's quiet here. True. At the Vape Shack in Odessa, Texas. Yes. www.vapeshackvs.com. Free publicity. Free. <laughs> Shout out. But anyway, so that's going on. Another thing I seen that really upsets me. Um, seen it on Facebook. Some guy actually posted. That he's a, he's a juice maker and he has successfully cloned mother's milk what? by Suicide Bunny. No, yeah. no, no. You don't clone juices. Well, that's his thing, and he's uh, trying to sell it now too. No. And um, there's a couple of guys that actually they actually tag Pip in it, Pip from uh, Suicide Bunny, and I hope she gets on him, man. I hope so too. I really, I mean, even calling it mother's milk. No, okay, no, like no, not you even like the name, not even like you know, I don't know, Tata Milk or. Whatever, it's like not even a knockoff version. Of, I mean, mother's milk, and I'm selling it to you. What? I was like, that's unbelievable. The thing, see, and this is what makes me mad with the whole clones versus authentic things. It's not, it's not just mods. Uh huh. You know, it's freaking now. It's juice. I've cloned really. Okay, so, um, let's see. I'm gonna spend you know 19 or 20 bucks on a clone version of the juice that I like, or I'm gonna spend 22 dollars on the authentic. 
Right, and support well, the and support the maker. Exactly. I mean, dude, if you if you're if you're good enough to clone the juice from her, make your own. Right. Start your own line. You know, that just it doesn't make sense to me. I don't understand why you'd want to clone. Why you want to be known for taking somebody else's idea and duplicating it? I don't, that doesn't seem right. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> but. Uh, Hey man, I'm a really good juice maker. I make awesome juice. What do you do? I clone uh, mother's milk and I, I clone five pawns and I clone. Really? What do you make of your own? Oh, I ain't got none of my own. I, I hadn't had a single original idea in my head since 1986. <laughs> but I could clone stuff. <laughs> it's like, really? What the hell is it? Uh, See, you need to be trolled and banned. Period. For sure. And that, that's not, let's bring that up too since uh, <laughs> we're running out of shit to say. We're always running out of shit to say. <laughs> it's all right though. If you're on my page. And then I'm sure it's like with other pages, but like if you're on West Texas Vaping Coalition on Facebook, you know, I, I try to do cool things for people. Right. Do juice giveaways or juice group buys and I do mod buys and, you know, all that other stuff. Um, don't tell me that you're interested in, you know, getting in on the group buy. And then when I ask you for the money, tell me you don't have money. Not only tell me you don't have money. Five seconds later, be on another page saying I want to buy a Tobe money in hand. <laughs> what? Oh man! What was, what was his name? Dustin White. Dustin White. God, baby Jesus, <laughs> Dustin White. Please tell me you're listening to this. You are the reason why I have an ulcer. Oh, you're the reason. Man. You're the reason why Landon has an ulcer. Because <laughs> yeah, people. That's definitely true. Because of people like you, man. If you if you say you're gonna do something, do it. Because at the end of the day, all we have is our word. That's it. Right. And when you go back on that, man, and that's why you got banned. We trolled him for like God two or three hours, <laughs> and then we banned him. Oh, that's great. So, and then actually, he went he went on the page that he was asking for the tobe and was going to troll him on that, but he couldn't message him. Oh, he blocked you. He has a twenty eight millimeter tobe that he wanted to buy. So, <laughs> and then not give it to him. <laughs> nice. Well, like so. I don't know. It's like me, you know. I I see all these group buys, you know, various different things, you know, juice mods, whatever. I don't jump in on it unless I know I have that kind of money laying around. Yeah, and then we texted him. Uh -huh. I said, "Dude, I need the money tonight because I got to make this." You know, I, the juice makers, they don't. You know, it's not like they pull it off a shelf and they send it to me. They make these bottles special, right? You know, so they need to know. I need a head count, so it's not like, oh, I just had to put a bottle back on the shelf. You know, because I get 120 milliliter bottles when I do my group eyes. Because who wants 30? Well, and that's awesome. I mean, it, yeah. you know, but I don't want to make them mad. You know, because I tell him, you know, well, you know, find out what MOQ is. You know, minimum order quantity. Right. And then you know, he tells me 10 bottles. I'm like, oh, that won't be no problem. We're up to 13, 14, or something like that. And two people backed out. I won't talk about the other person. <laughs> <laughs> Happens. But um, yeah. Then they back out of it, and it just makes me look like a douche because I sat there and told the juice maker, I got you covered. Like, yeah, I got it. And right. then, then I didn't. You know, and. Ended up, uh, we were good. I mean, he was he was very understanding, and uh, <laughs> I guess he's actually a friend on the page. Nice. So That's he saw good, the three hours of trolling. He's like, dude, I <laughs> thought I was gonna piss my pants. <laughs> I wish I would have witnessed this, but oh unfortunately, my. I was probably asleep. God, it was hilarious, it was, dude. It was it was hilarious. Was it yesterday? It was last night. Last night. Yeah, I was probably asleep. Yeah, it was, it was kind of late last night. Yeah, that's the problem with Fridays, man. Yeah, well, I go to bed early. I understand that, but it was you know that's my thing, man. If you if you're on my page. And you X one or X two or whatever you do, you're telling me that you're gonna buy it, buy it. Because if not, you're gonna get you're gonna get trolled. You're gonna get banned. Uh, there's more people out there that'll take your place. Hell yeah, there so. are. Definitely. That's how I got in on a, a group buy recently. You know, somebody backed out, and I was like, hey, I'm here. Yeah, I'll take it. But see, that was legitimate though. You know, like I did, like it wasn't finalized or anything like that. Right. It was still. Was that because something came up was that was beyond her control? Absolute control. Yeah. Well, I can't. Technically, I can't say that because she could have not did what she did. Choices were made that night. Yeah, choices bad choices. Made. But yeah. anyway, you know, at any rate, you know, she, I had you on on reserve, and that's the thing. I didn't have like with mods. Uh -huh. It's easy to have people on reserve that oh, want yeah. them. You know, with juice, it's like, you know, everybody wants it, wants it. There's no reserve list, so I couldn't just jump in and, and grab somebody. Right. That was my problem. Is like I don't want to go buy 120 mils of juice that I don't know if I'm gonna like or not. Exactly. That's why I didn't get on that 120 for the, the unicorn milk. Because I wasn't sure. And then I tried it, you know, a week before it showed up, and I'm like, oh, man, I wish I would have got in on that. Oh, shit happens. You know, like you said, you don't want to be stuck with 120 milliliters of something you don't like. Gra yeah, and I mean, yeah, I'm sure I could probably sell it, but but why? I don't want to wait around. Why take that chance? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, and that's what I tell a lot of people, too, especially if it's juice that I really like and I've tried it and I enjoy it. I'll tell them, look, if you don't like it and you have the nick that I use, and a lot of people, you know, most of the people around here are six. Right, they're, they're all a bunch of drippers. So, but, you know, I'll tell them, look, if you don't like it, I'll buy I'll it buy back it. off of you. Right. Like this this new one, like Pro Flake from, uh, from, where is it? Fog, uh, Fog Fuel. 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 Fog Fuel
fog fuel. Right, right, right. So that's that's the Pearl Flake is the one that we did, and I got to try it, man. I was like, oh, oh buddy. Well, when it comes in, or maybe this gentleman over here, let me try some of the His, Look, he's got a 30 mil bottle, and I swear to God, there's two drops left in it. I'll wait for the. I'll wait for it to come in. Uh oh. Are you serious? You're gonna let him take your last two drops? Are you he's sure? been holding on. Are to you the, sure, man? He's I mean, been holding on to these two drops. He's like, man, I got to wait. I, can't, I need more. I need more. Well, he used to work for the company. Okay, okay. And then he moved out here to you know get in the oil field because that's where everybody comes when they are mm-hmm. broken, dedicated. If you're broken, mm-hmm. lazy, stay the hell wherever the hell it is you are. We don't need you in West Texas. Right. But if you broken, dedicated, come on out. There's jobs aplenty. Three point one percent unemployment here. It's definitely awesome you to know, be in that jo- kind of economy. Jobs everywhere, man. Pizza delivery people making eighteen bucks an hour. Right. Plus tips. Plus yeah. Plus <laughs> tips. So that's, that's not including your tips. But a one bedroom it. apartment will cost you two thousand dollars a month. <laughs> So. Even in Monahan's, that stuff is that yeah. stuff is spendy. Man, Look, he's trying to get that last. Dude, I don't even know what the hell I'm gonna put it on. I'm having to put it on right this Here, second. Here, hold on. I'll, hold on. I'll drive this one off for you. We'll we'll, fi- we'll figure something out and we'll come back to you. I don't know because that mojito's on this one. Oh man, don't tell me that. I don't have anything. How's that work? Oh, dude, hold you, on, here, put it on there. There you go. It's fine. That thing's dried out already. There you go. Yeah, but that box don't work. No, it works with the tug. It doesn't work with the Mephesto. The Mephesto is shorter. I think I may have pushed the pin down too far. But it's going to be good. I'm telling you, man. This uh, this is what it reminds me of. Before you even vapor, I'm going to tell you. A crisp fall morning. Yeah, it's what you were telling me last week. <sighs> we'll see about that. I'm telling you, it's, like, it's almost like in between Thanksgiving and Christmas. Like Santa Claus is coming. I, I'm, that, that's the way it makes me feel. Look at your waist in it. Don't, don't, don't be wasting it. It's that good. Uh oh. Go, go, Power Rangers. I should really make it a point to put my phone on mute when we start. Yeah, I actually did that today. Oh, crud. Uh oh. Dun, dun, dun. No, the my. <laughs> Always when I'm recording, my uh my mechanic today is ready for my car, so now I gotta text my wife. Let's oh. do this. Screw it. I'm gonna put her on the air. Is this still that, on? That's what do you think? Yeah. Oh my. Uh, I, I will. I will. Oh, fall morning. Yes. I told you, it's not wonderful. And that's readily available, too. So uh, we can always get a hold of him. That's that's some good stuff. You know what? Uh, if anybody's listening that got in that group by and you don't want it, let me know. I'll take anything between six and zero. You got this turned up? Um, I do now. <laughs> Calling my wife, ladies and gentlemen. This is great radio. <laughs> this is great. Que pasta taco. Hello. Hola. What? Hola. Hola. Where are you at? Brittany. Okay, you're live on the radio right now. <laughs> well, not really live. We're recording. Okay. Okay. Uh, I just wanted to let you know we had to stop the show because uh, Aaron called and said he's ready for my truck. I was wondering if you can come get it. What your truck? Yes. Okay. What do you want me to do? Um. Take it to the mechanic. Take it to the mechanic. Okay, and then what do you want me to do? I guess wait. I don't know unless can Brittany like take you back to her house. Is oh, Andy? She's a little busy. Is Andy there? No. All right. Well, just come this way, and um, I'll figure something out. How long's your show? <laughs> hey, this, <laughs> this is a million dollar operation. Yeah, I'm sure it's not. How long is it? I got about twenty more minutes. Well, by the time I get there, you'll be done. Yep, there you go. Get your butt over here. <laughs> All right. I love you, baby. Why can't you just drive it over here? <laughs> You're going to have to, because I'm going to need you to pick me up from, uh... <sighs> never mind, I don't need your help anymore. That's, no. You do not, you do, truck, you, see, this is. Truck over here. I'm already on this side of town. This is what I'm saying. You do not put into the relationship as much as I'd like oh, you to. Oh, <laughs> as, struggle. As, as much as I'd like you to. Yeah. Fuck my left kid. Hey! Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. You need church. No. You need Jesus. No. You need Jesus. No, I already found Jesus. I'm waiting for you to find him. Oh, oh damn. And with that. Okay, well, I will. I'll, how about this? How about I call you when I'm at the shop? That would be a good idea. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. You have yourself a wonderful day. You too. I love you. <laughs> love you too, babe. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Oh, that was great. Wow. Well, Put on blast by my wife. Oh yeah, you were. Yeah, you were. It is the struggle. Now I'm quite. I'm curious though. Huh. She found Jesus. Is it you? 
No. Oh, my, oh man. No, my name's Dave. Dang. Jesus is the guy that cuts our grass. Oh, really? Yeah. I got a Jesus that cuts mine, too. I'm going to tell him 30 minutes just to be safe. All right, man. Sounds good to 30 me. 30 minutes, cool. Let's so what do you what are you having in your truck? Man, look, I, we're, I'm, I wanted to give that money for so we can build that road rig, right? Right. And um, so I'm driving down the road, and I go to hit, you know, hit, the, hit stop, I was going to say. Push the brake. <laughs> hit stop? Yeah, I was going to hit stop on my truck. Right and on. it just, dude, just, just rattling. Oh, no. So I guess my rotors are like toast. About four or five months ago, I started hearing a squeak. <laughs> and I guess that's when the little Warner bars tell you uh, that you need to change your brakes. Yeah. Well, then it stopped squeaking. So I'm like, hey, it uh, it's must good. be good. Now it's just the the rivets are what's stopping me. Oh, man. So I needed to get rotors. I needed to get brakes. And then I need to get a radiator flush and a rear trans flush. And Oh, man. But luckily, I have a great friend, Aaron. I know you listen, so that's pretty cool. Uh, my friend Aaron Laginus, we call him Laginus. I don't hit play. Oh, shoot. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> he works over at Premier Automotive. Uh, he's going to take care of me. This dude has been, like, he's one of the Ohio boys. He came down with us. Oh, so, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, we got a whole little clan. We, we kind of like, str- we're, we're like Arabs. We like strategically placed ourselves in places <laughs> that we needed to be in case we need shit. Hey, there you go. I just need someone at a liquor store. <laughs> I will be set. And maybe maybe a gun shop. Okay, so start calling the homies. The home. I don't have homies. <laughs> well, I'm. What do you mean? You I'm don't homeless have homies, down here, dude. Man. I don't. Because I've been only been down here three years. I don't know. I know, like, I'm talking about your homies up there. Oh, <sighs> call your homies up there and have them come mm. down here, man. Get my homies are dedicated for about 45 minutes, bro. Oh, man, they're they gonna ADD drive 27. They, yeah, they're not gonna drive 27 <laughs> hours to get my bag for nothing. Damn, That'd be that's like, dude, how long the drive is? 20, yeah, it's, uh, 1,475 miles. And you're talking about me going with you? Yeah. Oh man. Well, like dude, I let said, me take you to my hometown and let's go screw up my neighborhood. And, dude, and let's go screw up some vape stores. Well, there, there's dude. They've been popping up like crazy over there, but. I mean, I remember, the, I remember when you went last year or yeah. this year. I guess it would be. Yeah, I went in June, and uh, <laughs> you're talking about people. You know, they're, they're all Cardos. Yeah, cloud competitions, man. Yeah. It's like what? Joining cloud competitions with Cardo tanks. Oh man, That's I'm gonna go down there and be like. No, the crazy thing is, if you cloud. if you do over uh, if you do come over Christmas vacation, you're gonna see snow. So I haven't seen snow in a couple of years, man. Lot, dude. I went there last year, and it was. If we would have left 15 minutes later, we wouldn't have got home. Like, they, they got, I think, like, 90-something inches of snow. Is there any mountains close by? Um, You got the Irish Hills. Not mountain mountains, but there's hills. But you can go, is there, go is right up to Canada. Go, yeah, you can go right up to Canada. Dude, because I, I, mean, I like to snowboard. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Seriously, dude. Do you want to go? I'll take you up there. Boing, or not Boing, ride. but uh, Boing's down here, isn't it? I don't know. I used is to ride. Boing Mountain? I think it's Boyne. It's it's right up there. It's right. It's we can go. I used to ride. I miss it. That's the one thing I miss. I could take. Here. I could take you over to. And if anybody from Toledo's <laughs> listening, you're probably gonna laugh your ass off in about 14 <laughs> seconds. I could take you over to uh, Fort Meigs, and that's a big tubing hill. But it's just one hill straight down. And hey, if you don't hey, stop, you do it. If you don't stop, you shoot into the Maumee River. Dude, yes, it's hilarious. Dude. Yes, Trash as a kid, as, as, a, as a kid, it was like the greatest thing in the world to do. <laughs> but now that I think of it as an adult, I'm like, that was the dumbest, <laughs> dude. I'll the do it. Dumbest. I'll thing. do it right now. Like, soon as you get to the bottom of the hill, you got to dig your feet in because if you don't, uh-huh. you're into the river. Dude, trash can. Let's go. <laughs> well, see then. Oh, you know what? New Year's Day, you can do the polar bear plunge with me. I'm that's, down. I've done it. Cut a hole in ice and jump in. I've done it. It hurts so bad. I bet it's so cold. It hurts. It hurts so good. It hurts worse than you. <laughs> d- you dropping that bottle of cut with on. <laughs> I'll tell you off the air what I was going to say because it's, <laughs> you know, it's really bad. I got you. I got you. But uh, so yeah, that's uh, that'll be fun, man. I'd love to do that. We could broadcast. But we, we'll, you know what? We will. Uh, we'll work on the details of that. It'd be kind of fun. I think. I've, dude, like I said, you don't need anything. We'll stay with my friends. You know what I'm saying? Well, All I'm going to need to go. I'm going to need clothes. You know, I'm going to need that. You're, yeah, you're going to need clothes. <laughs> and when you see our mall, you're going to be like, son of a gun. Beautiful. See, you're going you're gonna to make me miss home, aren't you? Franklin Park Mall. What was it? Two floors. Just big, huge mall. See, you, you got to remember, though, I don't know if you've ever been to the Pacific Northwest. I don't know if you've ever been over yes. to Oregon, yeah, Portland area. Absolutely. Dude, there's like malls every like three feet. Yeah. It's like you walk out. Real, walk, real malls. Yeah, real malls. Like. You know, you're, you walk inside, there's an ice skating rink at one end, and then there's a concert hall at the other. It's like, whoa. Yep. Not like your work. <laughs> I'm sorry, that mojito got stuck in my throat. Oh, man. But now here, it's like it's like a 1987 swap meet. It's horrible. I love Odessa, but... Hey, whoa. Whoa, man. Chisholm's sending me friend requests and stuff on Facebook. 
I don't right. know. I don't know how I feel about that. Right now, yes. He just did. Yeah, what are you mind. doing, Chisholm? You're trying, trying to screw up the show. Man, you know I'm recording over here, Chisholm. <laughs> he wants to plug in the coffee, but yet. Is that what you texted him? Can I plug the coffee in? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Tyler, is it okay if I plug in the coffee pot? Denied. Denied. <laughs> no coffee for you. Actually, there's a there's a isn't there is there a microwave in the back? Yeah, there's a uh, microwave in the back if you want to nuke your coffee, Chiz. I think he did. Oh, Chisholm, did you did you nuke your coffee? There's a microwave in the back. No, oh, he's like I ain't going over there and make it warm. That? Hear this stuff? You know what? You know I'm denying your friend request right now, just so you know. See this? Denied. That's not even right, man. No, I I, I approved it. I'll be honest. Okay, I, I think we've like been way off track long enough. Um, you know what though? Who cares? Yeah, that's true. This is the last half. Yeah, this is the last half. We got some beady. So, uh, what's going on? Hey, I, I I'll tell you this locally too. What's up? You know we've had that that we had a bad rain Friday. Yeah, yeah, Friday afternoon. Uh huh. And I um, heard it. Trying to get across Midland, you know, to go over to uh, Academy to go get my son some last minute stuff for camping. Okay. Every retard with a truck around here. <laughs> first of all, the outside lane's completely water flooded. I mean, it's right. flooded, flooded. So they all just think it's a great idea to go, you know, 60 miles an hour and hit this water. Uh -huh. You know, and splash all the cars around them. I see this truck coming up. And I know he's going to do the same thing to me because the first 15 did it. <laughs> and dude, like, he is, like, just foot in the floor. I mean, you could, like, tell, you know, he's he's moving. And I'm like, okay. And he come up, like, right where I was at was where the deepest part of the water was. And I seen him start to hit the water. And as soon as he started hitting the water, I slammed on my brakes as fast as I possibly could. <laughs> and he comes shooting by, and I could, like, it was slow motion. I seen him go like that. And when he did that, his truck just completely just, there, it was hydroplane and it had no control all over the place, up over the curb, into the grass. Oh, man. And when he drove by, I was like, that was awesome. <laughs> I think he was uh, mad. One finger wave. Yeah, he, one was, finger wave. he, was, a, he was a jerk ball. Apparently. So if you listen to the show, sir, good going. You're the reason why. It should be legal to shoot people. You're you're a real winner, sir. <laughs> wiener, you're a wiener. <laughs> so that's that's my. I guess that's my rant. I had a couple of rants this half. I'm sorry about that. Hey, you know what? We all have them. Well, that, that was mine. Well, I don't have any right now. Well, that's a good thing, man. Yeah, I don't, I don't usually know. you're the one's got a like the black cloud over your head. <laughs> actually, you know what? I'm actually having a good day today. Besides spilling the cut wood earlier, but I got you with that. that yeah, so. I mean that's why I'm okay. You know, I'm I'm. I'm, you I'm know doing what? all right. You know, and you know why I'm doing super okay? Why is that? I got on the Pandora list for the Pandora box mod. I'm really happy about that. Nice. I got my I got my uh, variant coming too. I got a titanium variant coming. So uh, life has been good. Page is doing well. We're almost at 600. How close are we? I, I haven't. Um, uh, as of right it. now, as we speak, well, we just added one more this morning. We know about that. We oh, did that's that right. I forgot about that. We did that one on the air. So. That's right. That was an on the air one. Let's see. West Texas Raven Coalition. Let's see how many peoples we got. Oh, Christy's here. And Melvin. And Melvin. And I didn't notice that. How's five, everybody doing today? 594. Everybody's doing good. Right 594. That is awesome. Yep. Six more. Melvin and Christy just showed up. How you guys doing? I thought you guys were going to a 180 for the grand opening. You didn't feel feel like it. Okay, are you doing better today? Okay, hey, um, local, lo another local shout out. Are you guys doing your haunted house type thing this year? Are you doing a Halloween party? Oh man, you guys locally at the Vape Shack. If you aren't friends with Melvin and Christy yet, come make friends with them right now. I missed last year because I had to work, but I heard that their Halloween parties are like. They're they're the big thing. Well, it's Friday. Halloween is a Friday this year. If you weren't oh, aware, oh, is it really? So I will actually be coming and chilling that Friday. You just stay the weekend at my house, so you can come in. Arranged. Okay. Let's cool. Do it. That'll be fun. Uh, well, that's if we haven't even been officially invited <laughs> yet. <laughs> well, if not, we'll still hang out. Not Melvin's handing me something over here. What's that? That's a that's a variant, right? What's that's on top? Variant, right. With the 26, oh, the brass monkey. The twenty six. The twenty six millimeter brass monkey. Authentic too, huh? Oh, hold on. I got to try this. That's good. What that is that? That looks wonderful. Tricks? That's good. That's good stuff. Wow. That's that's a chance. Is that the only one that you got? I've got, uh, I do have one away. How much are they?
Yeah. So it's a full kit. That's for 200 awesome. bucks, so you get all three tubes, you get the 22 millimeter slant cap, a black tube. Okay. Okay. Wow, that's awesome. Copper, brass, and they're all. Are they all the? Are they all 20 or 18 six? Are twenty six six fifties? So you get all three tubes and three different three different metals. You get the the drip tip. Oh wow, wow. that's a huge <laughs> hole! Oh my God. Damn. And you get this badass hold on, RDA. Hold on. T- take that drip tip out again. Take that. Look drip at this tip thing, man. Again. Mark that. We're mark. We're gonna have to. That is that is ginormous, folks. <laughs> that reminds me of. Uh, you got it. Yeah, I got it. Jesus. I, took, I took two pictures, man. I want to make sure. Oh, okay, that's like a. <laughs> that's gorgeous. Oh man, I think I'm about to buy one of those. It is. Really, for two hundred bucks, and it says probably made in Los Angeles. That is that that here. Talk for a second. I'm talking for a second <laughs> because David's vaping on. <laughs> that bad That's ass awesome, brass monkey. Hey, I need you to check out uh, check out my um, my K fund. Gabriel put a Clapton coil in it last night. There's no reason for a K fund to have that much vapor <laughs> production and flavor to boot. Okay. Yeah. Damn. How deep is that well? <laughs> On the variant. That's insane. Oh, so like I said, guys, get you know, get your butts down here and meet Melvin and Christy if you haven't done it yet, because for sure. these are some good people. They are. For some reason, they let us come and take up a third of their building because we're <laughs> fat. <laughs> yep. Yeah. And uh, do our little radio show here. So, okay, it's not a third, but that's cool, man. I, I'm definitely when those come in, I'm I'm game. Really nice, nice. And it works right. And it's right. I mean, look at the look at the width of the variant versus that. It's beautiful. Yeah, it looks like it well. belongs there. Jesus, that's crazy. No. So he bought himself a big piece of wood. <laughs> no. Eighteens. Eighteens. <laughs> that's a big box. <laughs> look at the size of that thing. It's enormous. Yeah, I like it though. I know. That's like, oh. I guess it's, it's like he put he could put juice in there, like a juice storage. I probably could. Ten mil <laughs> syringe. There you go. Do what you got to do, right? It is. It is a struggle. Oh, the Halloween party oh, is costume, man. So can we just come as DJs? Son of a bitch. <sighs> How about we come as a, a skinny people? <laughs> that is right i forgot about that stay puff marshmallow man dude that's done done <laughs> i'm gonna come as a michelin man <laughs> do the scary stuff just do like a fun thing absolutely awesome. i think that'd be cool we need you need to get that up on the site and you need to get it up on the on the you know, www.vapeshackvs.com, you know, and just to let the locals know that that's going on. And let's see if we can piss off those neighbors across the street. I know they're not listening. Right. D- they what? Why? Okay. Here's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> My next rant. Sidetracked as always. <laughs> oh, I pushed the wrong but Here's my rant. Crappy neighbors. It's been, it, it takes more energy to be a crappy neighbor than it does just to be a good neighbor. Why do something like that and be like, oh, I'm going to call the cops? Because you know they're looking out the window going, oh, I bet they're having fun. <laughs> I wish I was there. Man, I bet they're having a Have blast. you guys ever thought about inviting them? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. They just don't show up. No, oh, that's no fun. I'll tell you right now, that's get, let's get them evicted so I can move in and I'll come every year. We'll, we'll, we'll just, the no we'll fun just, fence. We'll, 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 just, we'll just party between the two houses instead of just one. That's, she, said, <laughs> she said the no fun fence. <laughs> yes, she did. Look at this side of the street. Tons of fun. That side of the street, not, not so, so much. much. <laughs> not so much. Not so much fun over there. 
I don't know. It just takes. It just seems like it takes too much energy out of your out of your life just to be a bad person, just to like be mean to people or hate people. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'd say things like that, like "Oh man, I hate him," or "Oh, I hate this," or "I hate that." But to like go out of your way to do it, yeah, man, I'm 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 too lazy for that. Like, <laughs> I look, feel you. I'm supposed to hate you, dude, but I'm tired. Of just, I'm tired of the hatred. Get, let's go get something to drink. Yeah, let's go a beer or something. <sighs> That's the way it works, man. Yeah. That's the way it works. So it does. Um, let's see. We did. We covered. We covered the Cloud Nine scandal. Yeah, that was definitely a scandal. Yeah, I, yeah, I guess. <laughs> uh, we covered the clone thing of the juice. Pip, if you're out there, we're sorry. Go get him, man. Go get him, honey. Cause, Tear him a new yeah, one. Yeah, you're, you're the innovator. They're the imitator, and you know that. Um, covered random stuff, like always. Always, always. I'm trying to think of what else I would like well, to cover. Well, hopefully later on we'll oh, do Oh, I know what we got to do. Of the juice giveaway. Yeah, let's do the juice. Um, the juice the, the juice maker was supposed to be here, and he's not. So uh, what we're going to do is I'm going to ask Melvin. Let me get to the let me get to the page. Do, 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 do. Where is it? We're going to go to the juice page for the contest. For the, what was it? 240 mil bottle? 240 mil bottle of juice. We're not saying what the name is. We're not saying who it's from. We're just saying it's juice, but it's going to be good juice. It's That's great juice. It gets traded for things like Geppettos and Waparis and, and children. And children, yes. Okay, where the heck did it go? That's not know. it. Where did it go? That's not it. Gold that variant for an E7? I think that's a... You are? It's going to be Josh Fox's E7. Oh, uh, of course. Let's see here. Where is this? Where, Where did it? it go? What do you want? I want the contest thread. There's no reason for it to be that low. Podcast contest thread. Okay, here we go. Find it. All right, Melvin, I need you. I need you to pick a number. This is how we're going to do it. So everybody that entered the contest thread for the for the 240 mil bottle of juice from uh, the random juice maker, uh, he was going to come in and we're going to do a randomizer and all that stuff, but we're going to do it live right now. Well, not really live because we're, we're going to listen to this and we're not going to be around. But um, I'm going to have Melvin just pick a number between one and one in how many we got? One, two, three, 14, four, 14, 15, 15. Yeah. Pick a number between one and 15. Three. Number three. Haven Carr. Haven. And Haven said that uh, his first vape that he had was Coyote's Blood from Vape Shack. That was the first juice that he ever vaped. Haven, congratulations. Uh, you just won a 240 mil bottle of um, of that juice, that orange stuff that you like so much. I so, Look, somebody gave it away. Who gave it away? Odie. Who? Somebody, somebody said what the juice is. Oh, okay. Well, whatever. Yeah, right. Where at? Orin? <laughs> no, OD. Not Orin. OD. OD. Where do you see OD? He's two above Haven. Or one or two above Orin. Orin? Yeah, Orin posted at the bottom. Right at the bottom. Oh, cheese and rice. See it? Oh, yeah. No, that's, well, that's, that's, a, not cool. that's a douchebag move. Yeah, it is. Well, anyway, congratulations, Mr. Haven Carr. You just won a 240 mil bottle of juice. Congratulations, vape, vape crazy, because you're going to have enough uh, to uh, do it. Yeah, you are. So there you go. Is that it? Are we done? We are done. We can, we, can, we can call it. No, I, I want to make sure, man. I oh, give, dude, I promise you we can call it. I want to give them Would give the the people worth? their money's worth. <laughs> <laughs> There's no money, but. Right. Like we said, we're at no budget right now. We're working our way up to low budget. So yes, we are. trying to get to low budget. If we can get to low budget. We're things, golden. Things are gonna be good. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. Well, that's cool, guys. Uh, once again, that is uh, episode three. Thrice. Of uh, WTVC at night. Once again, thanks for listening. We do appreciate it. And uh, any topics you need us to cover or you want us to cover, go ahead and shoot us an email or shoot us something up on the post on West Texas Vaping Coalition. Hold on. Okay, Melvin okay, has Melvin's a topic got- for next week. Let's hear what it is. We went, we went over that. We already went over that today. Yeah, yeah, yeah we went over that we today. Did. Yeah, two point five billion dollars, man. That's which is on. Unre- I and mean, you as a store owner should be just floored. You know, I mean, what I would like to do, what I would really love to do for a lo- just locally, I wish there was a a quantifiable way to find out. You know, where your yearly per of that was. 
you know and how did it how did it you know how did it impact the community how did it help the city because you're paying your taxes and everything else and you guys are you know you guys give back all the damn time you know what if you weren't here god we'd be doing this over at uh Ugh. We're somewhere else black gold or all right. <laughs> <laughs> I can't be mean. They're our neighbors. Right. I, I doubt they're listening. Anymore. Nobody listens to the show. <laughs> right. So, Christy does. Hey, Christy does. Thank so you. There, there's four people now. There's four people that <laughs> listen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're, we're, we're getting, at 146 we're, right now. Yeah, we're getting there. We're yeah, at 146. It's, it's, it's a it, look. We're fat. It's a slow trot. We're getting there. We yeah. just, we gotta we gotta build up momentum. We, we, we run marathons at a snail pace. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> oh, oh snap! Melvin just said that if we can get up to 500 listeners, he said it won't be listeners no more. He will buy cameras for the podcast. They'll be watchers. They'll be watchers. Actually, what we really would need is. We'll, we'll discuss line. that. We'll, we'll 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 discuss what we really need to do. This we're going to put speakers been, outside, and we've we're already gonna, been working towards this already. We're going to build a stage right yep. here. And we're, no, no, <laughs> not really. You don't want us in front of your store. They want to see your <laughs> store. You're like, I know the va- they said it was behind two fat. Oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> behind the two fat guys. Yep, <laughs> this is a lot true. of real estate. Anyway, thanks a lot for listening, guys. We will see you next week. Till then, vape safe and vape happy. Always.